Hello and welcome to the OWC instructional series of videos. In this installment, we will be upgrading the memory in an Intel iMac. Here we have a 24-inch Intel iMac 2.16 GHz Core 2 Duo machine, but the memory installation instructions are the same for all the white Intel processor-based iMacs, regardless of screen size, processor speed, and whether you have a Core Duo or a Core 2 Duo machine. Before you get started, you will need to clear a space to work where you can place your iMac flat on its screen. To protect the screen while you're working, lay the machine gently on a clean bath towel or other gently cushioned surface. As you can see, I've placed the machine face down on its screen, protecting the front with a cushioned anti-static pad. Apple does provide pretty clear diagrammed instructions on the bottom of the pedestal. The first step is to remove the memory compartment door, which is held in place by two screws. As you can see, the screws are held in place in the door, so there's no need to worry about dropping one of the screws while performing this upgrade. Next, pull outward on the two memory release levers. You will feel some resistance as the memory module or modules are unseated. The memory is now free to remove from the machine. We are now ready to install the memory into the iMac. Let's refer back to the diagram on the pedestal of the machine and notice that the module is notched toward one side. The diagram shows that that notch should be aligned toward the left-hand side of the memory slot in order to slide in properly. So let's go ahead and slide the module into one of the two slots as instructed. If you've kept the module straight, it should slide easily to be flush with the outside of the slot, but now it needs a little more push. You will feel and possibly hear the module click into place. We can do the same with the second module, making sure the notch is to the left and again pushing the back of the memory to feel the click into place. Now we need to return the memory release levers to their home position by pushing the levers inward. You may feel a little resistance here as well and that's perfectly alright. However, do not close the levers without fully seating the memory modules first. All that is left is to put the memory compartment door back on. Simply line up the door and tighten the two screws. You're ready to put your machine upright, plug the cables back in, and turn the unit on. 